Hey y'all, it's Jack. Uh, we're going to Florida. Where are we going? Naples. Naples, Florida. And we're gonna be doing some fishing and beaching and lots of eating. So um, as far as the fishing part, let's get ready. I bought this for Lauren in a combo. It was a pretty good deal at Academy, but uh, it has 20 pound braid on here and I'll be using it for just light tackle, throwing a small jig, probably a um, gulp shrimp, new penny color. Then I have a 4,000 pen uh, battle two. Love this reel. I have a couple of these, a couple of the 3,000s, 4,000, 5,000, um, 6,000 even, this is a 6,000. And um, these things are fairly inexpensive and they're bulletproof. I, I can't remember the last time I even washed these after them being in salt water, which is probably not a good thing. But so I got a 4,000 and a 6,000 and this is basically a pen 3000. Um, as far as rods, I have some cheap rods that I put them on when I'm traveling. So I'm gonna be flying and obviously you can't take a full length rod on the plane. So what I do is, this is just a cheap crappy rod, Zebco rod, and it breaks into two, super whippy tip. I'll use that for the 3000. Um, and then I have a, you know, a cheap Shakespeare rod. I'll use this for the 4,000 and then another uh, ugly stick. And this has some backbone on it, but it is, uh, it gets taken down into two parts. So what I do is I'll pull these all apart. Simple package. I've never had any issues with TSA or the airlines with taking it as a carry-on. Um, it's, they're pretty slim, so you can put them um, along your seat. Generally, I'll put it in the, the overhead compartment kind of after everyone fills it up. I'll just put it, kind of put it on the outside and close it. And then I've also slipped them into a um, suit carrying case. Uh, when I went to a wedding, just slip the rods down the suit carrying case and um, hang it up in the coat closet at the front of the aircraft. So, a um, couple different ways. You can also check it, but I'd rather carry it on, make sure it doesn't get broken. Uh, day pack, Mountain 2700, and I'll just strap these on the side in the water bottle holder. And I've always flown like that. I'd never go to Florida without a fishing rod. Um, we'll be fishing off a inshore boat and potentially a bay boat and maybe do some some beach fishing but i always like to bring my own gear and i'll, I'll pick up tackle when i get there Good one, Bill.
Should have brought bigger hooks. Head of the jack, stripped. <laughs> Wow, Jack, what a fish and we still have our bait. <laughs> Giant grouper. Yeah. Working. back from Florida. We caught some fish. We had some good times, celebrated Lauren's birthday and ate lots of good food. So thanks for tuning in and uh, stay tuned for future episodes. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>